Hey, it's me, that shiner guy, and I'm going to catch some shiners for a fishing trip tomorrow morning. So I thought I'd bring you guys along and show you a little bit more detail what I'm doing to catch my shiners. Um, the most important thing is to chum the water. This is just regular chicken feed. I'm just going to add a bunch of water to it to, to get it more moist so it'll sink better. I'm going to go around the area you see behind me. I like to fish the outside of lily pads. Um, I'm usually in four or five feet of water, maybe a little bit deeper, but it usually has a nice sandy bottom. So when the net falls down to the bottom, um, I don't have a lot of grass getting in the net. And I'm usually finding a shiner sticking close to cover, but towards a deeper side when I bait them up with the uh, chum. So we'll run around here, we'll bait up four or five spots, we'll start throwing the net, and we'll see what we come up with for tomorrow's trip. So uh, it's nothing crazy, nothing, uh, nothing hard to do, but we'll, uh, we'll catch some shiners here. So all I'm really using is normal dry chicken feed that I've wet down. I got a couple of five gallon buckets with a portable aerator set up on it. And so this is just as simple as it gets. I'm in an old 12 foot John boat. Just got a little 40 foot pound trolling motor mounted on the back of it. No outboard, nice and quiet. So this is, this is what I use as basic as it is to go out and catch shiners. I like to pick out distinctive areas where I can throw this chum in to a certain spot pretty sure I can come back in a little bit and throw the net back in the same place. Out there, but let's see if anything comes up. I think I see a flash or two there. A lot of grass down there. Got something. Alrighty. Alrighty then. Let's get a look. See at what we got. I'm pulling this weed off. Woo! Everybody's jumping around. Got shiners, shiners, and more shiners. Variety of sizes here. Some of them are pretty small. They'll go some other stuff. I don't keep the brim. I'm just out here looking for shiners. I'm really bigger than I want, so both of them going back to make more babies. That's what we were looking for. That's the one. Look at that. This is what we caught today. Spent a couple hours, made a lot of casts. Used uh, probably about four gallons of chum. Um, caught quite a few. So, uh, you know, it, it works. It takes a hit and miss. Some spots don't produce. Some spots you keep chumming and chumming, they'll produce. You never know where you're gonna get them at, but if you keep working at it, you can, you can land some shiners and, you know, have some free bait. Any questions, guys? Leave me comments and stuff. I'll uh, I'll put some links down for some of the chemicals I use in the tank. And any questions, just uh, just leave me a comment. Thanks.